you look at the context of when I had that little challenge match mm -hmm. from that guy on Facebook, and if you see that sparring footage where I'm like obviously going hard trying to hurt the guy, you think, oh, Quan, Quan just only goes hard. But if you watch my videos of me sparring with my students, mm -hmm. I'm going super light. Like you can see that I can control myself. It's just that, uh, you know, in um, certain situations, you want to make it look hard. And if somebody's challenging you to a fight, you don't want to light spar. So mm -hmm. I thought he was challenging me to a fight, bro. So I'm going to go hard. I gave him pads. Mm -hmm. We both had pads. I mean, there's a video of me and Shane talking about the guy who challenged me. I think it was like 2007. This is what I'm talking about where I had all these, like, I didn't have any sanctioned kickboxing bouts, but I had all these little unsanctioned matches with people, hard, mm -hmm. you know, basically fights. And I only got one of them on camera, but that was the one from the guy who was challenging me on Facebook saying, I'm going to kick you in the face, man. Let's spar. I'm going to kick you in the face. Beat you up. Let's go. <laughs> but is this video on, on YouTube? Like you posted yeah. it up? Because I, I haven't seen it yet. So I'll, I'll, um, I'll go find it. If you, you can also pop on my Instagram. If you pop mm -hmm. on my Instagram and you scroll down, you'll see a video of me. It looks like in a garage and we're wearing like helmets and stuff. And, uh, and me and this guy. And I had like mm -hmm. pink gloves on because that's all I had extra in the garage. Mm -hmm. um, and then we were just going at it. Just, and it was only like a round because he was done after the first round. Wait, wait a second. I, I think it's starting to, to, to come back to me now. Now that you mentioned pink gloves in your garage, I, I think I might've seen that video, but it's been a little while. So I don't, uh, I didn't remember. Hmm. Yeah. So basically this was early internet, right? Mm -hmm. This is, um, back in the days of like when Facebook was still new and, uh, nobody really knew the etiquettes of the internet. It was 2007. Right. Mm -hmm. So this dude was like talking crap and you're not supposed to like, if somebody says, Oh, let me give me your address so I can come to your house and, and fight you. Like common sense is you don't give them, they're a crazy person. You don't give them your address. Mm -hmm. When I was in an arrogant little ass and I didn't know that the, that there were crazy people on the internet really. Um, so I was like, yeah, sure. Here you go. So in a private message, yeah, come on. I, I thought he wouldn't come. And then I was like, well, if he does come, I'm going to beat this shit out of him. Like, let's go, let's go. But I mean, his, his, uh, it turns out that he was joking or that's what he was saying is it, later. He was joking. I don't know if he really was joking or just after the fact, he was like, no, man, I was just kidding about kicking you in the face. I'm like, how is someone on the internet supposed to tell you're joking when you're just typing in text? Let me fight you. I'm going to kick you in the face. Like, I can't hear any tone in your text. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's you, know? you, so, got, you, got, you got to use emojis, man. <laughs> or else, like, <laughs> I don't even know if there were emojis back then. Like, Oh, yeah, it's true. This is back 2007, in 2007, right? Yeah, not much of so, a... Uh -huh. It was crazy. Yeah. So basically he ended up coming out and he was like, and he wasn't real aggressive. He was just like friendly. And I was just like, this is weird. Like you're just telling me you're going to kick me in the face. And I was like, all right, well, you want to spar? And he's like, yeah, yeah. Let's put some gear on. Let's go. Uh -huh. So, uh, but not in a, in a, in a, in a aggressive way. He was just like, it was just a, a day at the office. Right. Mm -hmm. So we, we geared up. And I was like, all right, so we're going to go uh, K1 rules. How about that? K1 rules, good. Mm -hmm. And he's like, yeah, K1 rules, good. I'm like, all right, we'll do three rounds, three minutes. And, you know, we got the good gear. We'll go a nice hard spar. Good, good hard spar. <laughs> <laughs> so I was up front with him. I was like, all right, we'll, we'll see. And then I think I've cracked a, a, a smart ass joke. Like, oh, we'll see who, who kicks who in the face. All right. Mm -hmm. And so we had the little timer going and we did the first round and I just was just like, all right, I'm going to smash him. So I just went full circle on Yomas, just, just smashing him with back kicks, pressuring him with punches. Like he was like hunched over and I'm like, oh, this guy's a noob. The first tell, like he was acting so awesome on the, the internet. But as soon as I put some, just hit him like with one jab immediately, he just goes like this. He just bends over. And then I'm like, uppercut, uppercut. Like, you know, you can see the clips of it. Like, it, it's chopped up, but any, any spot where it's chopped is just like a uh, space where I'm waiting to see if he's okay or, you know, if he's coming in or what. But, um, yeah, like, because uh, I had edited, the only footage I have left of it was footage that I had chopped up and edited for, like, a demo. 
Mm -hmm. So that's what's left, but it was only just one round. It was one, one round in the beginning of the next, and then he just quit. Mm, um, okay, okay. But yeah, so I was going hard, and then after that, uh, he was like, "Oh, yeah, good match. You guess uh, you can't you can't beat me up there." <laughs> and I'm like, "Yeah, yeah, now it's funny. That's funny now, isn't it? Yeah, yeah." And then uh, he just took his licks like a champ, and then we kind of just became friends after that. And um, so he had skill, he had good kicks and stuff, mm -hmm. but he didn't have a, any like knockout kickboxing he didn't have any sparring against an opponent who had bad intentions i had bad intentions right mm -hmm. he was not used to that so it you know but now he is now like he's way better now than what he was for sure but uh yeah so we, we became friends after that but that's that was uh one of those matches i was talking about like little challenge things and that's the, but that's the only one i have any video footage of because i still didn't even have my own camera back then 